goes too far. The corporations that we worked for decided to send their other assassins to kill both of us because they grew tired of our constant failures to kill each other. I had just started getting my strength back, but my wife was still completely exhausted. I knew at that moment that what I was feeling had evolved from hatred to pure, honest love and a need to protect the only person in the world. who could last as long as I could in a fight and make me smile in a fight again. I literally held her close to me with one arm and used my other arm to swing the heavy sword on my back. I fought so much to keep her safe that the muscles in my body were literally tearing themselves apart from overuse. When I finally had killed the last assassin sent to kill us, I didn't even have the energy or the strength to even breathe anymore. So I fell backwards and collapsed, completely unconscious. My wife lay on top of me, also completely unconscious. A caravan of merchants found us and brought us to the local city and brought us to the hospital. Or at least what you could classify as a hospital in that small little town. When we came to She spoke first and asked, she asked me why did I save her. I said the corniest, easiest line you could ever think of. Why wouldn't I? During our fight I seemed to have fallen in love. For the next twelve months, we went around the world killing various evil people along the way. And falling in love with each other even more. Until eventually. I asked her to marry me, and she said yes. We've been together ever since.
Well, as a demon king, I'm. Let's see if I can remember my own age on the top of my head. Ah, yes. 96,882 years as of today. My wife is technically only five seconds younger than me. As a demon, I can literally see the age of every person that I look at. I have to purposely use my ability. I tend not to pry into a person's personal life or their personal facts unless I have no choice. Technically, yes, you can classify it like that. Only my ability is a lot more complicated. I can't see when they're going to die. I can just see the exact age they would technically be classified on a universal scale. Another ability I have, thanks to my eyes, is it is impossible to lie to me. Well, to my eyes, everyone has an aura. This aura is classified as a small little wisp of smoke floating above their heads. The aura changes depending on the emotion you're feeling at the time. The stronger the emotion, the more your aura changes to that color. If you lie, the aura takes on a solid black color. Even if he was, there would be no reason to fight. I do not view him as a threat. I already told you, Savannah. You and I are sparring partners. I wouldn't turn down a fight against you because 